Hey, I'm Abby, and this is a look at Cloud Code's support for custom samples. Enterprise application development poses unique challenges when juggling multiple organization requirements and dependencies. But what if you had a central starting point to build applications configured to your organization's needs? That's where Cloud Code's custom samples feature can help out. Custom samples can be starter applications, services, or infrastructure configurations that are easy to share with your team. This gives your team a convenient, secure, and discoverable starting point that adheres to your organization's tech stack and compliance needs. Custom samples also encourage best practices at the beginning of your development cycle and helps accelerate the time to market for your team's ideas. To get started with custom samples, your organization first needs to define applications and services in a version to Git repo that includes their techniques for improving security, compliance, and other app requirements. Once configured, this is called a custom samples repo. Developers with permission to the custom samples repo can then use cloud code to connect to your organization's custom samples repo, letting them easily import individual apps and services. That way, your developers spend more time coding and less time configuring apps to meet your organization's requirements. Cloud Code is available for a variety of IDEs, including JetBrains IDEs, VS Code, and Cloud Shell Editor. For this video, I'll demo custom samples with Visual Studio Code. I already have Cloud Code installed from the VS Code Extensions Marketplace, so I'm ready to go. Let's say my engineering manager has set up a custom samples repo of starter applications that my team frequently uses. All these apps can easily be imported into my IDE's workspace with Cloud Code. To show what this flow looks like, I'll use an example Git repo the Cloud Code team made. What makes this Git repo a custom samples repo is the inclusion of one file, .cc template. They look something like this. Every samples folder in your repo needs to be referenced in this file. But let's go back to importing this custom samples repo. First, I'll grab the git URL for the repo. Switching back over to VS Code, I can go through the same flow of creating a sample app, but instead of selecting a Kubernetes or Cloud Run app, I'll instead click Custom Application. Then I'll click Import Sample from Repo and paste in the URL of the repo. All the samples from that repo are now ready to be individually imported into my workspace. And now I'm ready to code up a surface that has all the dependencies I need already included. If you want to set up a custom samples repo for your organization, you can fork our example custom samples repo and customize it to meet your organization's needs. If you have any questions or feature requests about cloud code, join our Slack channel. Until next time.